Welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to talk about the top 10 hottest must-watch Korean BL series you shouldn't miss out. Number 1. Sing My Crush. After a disastrous first encounter between Baram and Han Tae during their school years, the two strike up an unlikely and close friendship in the aftermath. Years later, will Baram be able to keep his crush on Han Tae a secret any longer? It has eight episodes. Number 2. Bon Appetit. Yoon Su is a dedicated office worker who immerses himself in his job, shuttling between home and the office day in and day out. His life seems monotonous, filled with loneliness and sadness. However, one day, his life is completely turned upside down by his neighbor, Do Hoon. Do Hoon is Yoon Su's junior in college, a young man who suddenly dropped out of school. One day, Do Hoon appears in front of Yoon Su, holding a bowl of sweet rice soup as a housewarming gift. Yoon Su accepts this dessert, and suddenly, his world brightens as the sweetness warms his weary soul. Do Hoon confesses that he once lacked the courage to confess his feelings to Yoon Su and chose to avoid him. However, over the years, Do Hoon has put this past behind him, while Yoon Su begins to unconsciously care about Do Hoon from that moment on. From that day forward, Yoon Su and Do Hoon's lives undergo a transformation. After work, they spontaneously become a perfect pair for sharing meals, and every meal becomes precious quality time for them. Yoon Su even realizes that his feelings for Do Hoon are growing warmer and deeper with each passing day. It has eight episodes. <laughs> Number 3. Love Tractor. Due to feeling lost in life, Hai and Yul, a city man with zero ability to survive in the countryside, comes to his grandfather's rural home. In front of him appears Yi Chan, a passionate young man who loves farming. While learning about rural life and assisting with farming tasks, Hai and Yul gradually finds himself drawn to Yi Chan's warm and straightforward nature. Between these two individuals, each burdened with their own worries, a youthful and lively rural healing romance unfolds, full of ups and downs. It has eight episodes. <laughs> Number 4. A Shoulder to Cry On. At school, Lee Da Yeol spends most of his time living as an outsider. Not popular by any stretch of the imagination, Day Yell's only real joy comes from his time spent with the Archery Club. A talented archer whose skills have earned him a scholarship to the school, Day Yeol doesn't mind being an outsider, so long as he's free to pursue his greatest passion. But an ill timed run in with a devilishly handsome classmate lands him in trouble and places his precious scholarship in jeopardy. One of the school's most popular students, Jo Tae Hyun has always enjoyed a level of freedom that very few high school students have ever attained. Able to get away with practically anything, the entire school has no problem believing his side of the story when he's caught fooling around in the nurse's office with another student and Da Yeol. Claiming Da Yeol was trying to make out with him, Tae Hyun thoughtlessly puts the archer's scholarship at risk. Desperate to correct the misunderstanding, Da Yeol does everything he can to try to quell the rumors but no matter how hard he tries, it's just not enough. Completely unremorseful about what he's done, Tae Hyun seems to take a wicked sort of delight in doing everything he can to make Da Yeol's life miserable. His favorite method being to follow Da Yeol everywhere. Unable to shake Tae Hyun, Da Yeol spends his days loathing his shadow but the more time he spends with him, the more conflicted his feelings become, leaving him to wonder, where exactly does the line between hate and love end? It has seven episodes. <music> Number 5. Individual Circumstances. Ha Yeon Woo was once the toast of Chung Yuro's soul, 
South Korea's answer to America's Hollywood. As a maverick young movie director, his debut film was a massive hit for both filmgoers and critics alike. But after this auspicious start, he fell into a lengthy slump. He is now listless and unsure if he is really cut out to be a top movie director after all. One day, he meets Sung Woo Jae, a famous fiction writer who he once knew but has not spoken to for some time. Sung Woo Jae also has demons, however. His first love ended in sadness, and he took solace in his writing, eventually going on to become a prolific web-based novel author. Their meeting ignites a passionate romance that burns as bright as the flames of war. Will this relationship heal Sung Woo Jae's wounds and lift Ha Yi An Woo out of his slump? It has eight episodes. Number six. All the liquors. Han Ji Yu is an employee on the marketing team of a liquor company. Park Ki Hoon, on the other hand, is a devilishly charming, skillful chef of a famous restaurant. When Ji Yu is asked to contact Ki Hoon's restaurant in search of a potential collaboration, he runs up against a few walls, namely, Ki Hoon's flat out refusal to sell any alcoholic drinks in his restaurant. But Ji Yu is not ready to just give up. What will he do to break the stubborn chef? Two men from different walks of life learn to open up to each other through the intoxicating power of love. It has eight episodes. Number 7. Our Dating Sim. A story about what happens when two men who have been friends since school days meet again at work and create a dating simulation game. It has eight episodes. <laughs> Number 8. Jun and Jun. His childhood first love, Choi Jun, who disappeared without a word, returned as a hot general manager. An office rom com about idol turned intern Lee Jun and Choi Jun, a heart fluttering genius director. It has 8 episodes. Number 9. A Breeze of Love. Ban Dong Wook is suffering from chronic insomnia every night and it gets worse with the bad weather. One day in those painful days, he falls into a deep sleep next to Lee Du Hyun by chance. That's how Du Hyun, the only shelter for Dong Wook, becomes irreplaceable to Dong Wook. Hanging out together, Du Hyun has a crush on Dong Wook and tries to confess. However, it didn't go well as planned. Dong Wook only receives a gift not knowing who gave it to him and Du Hyun misunderstood it as he was dumped. Stuck in a misunderstanding, they drift apart. Five years later, on campus, they met again in the basketball game. However, they still have different feelings about each other. Their relationship, started with first love and ended in misunderstandings, continues again in campus. Will they be able to reconnect their broken TIs? It has eight episodes. Number 10. The Eighth Sense. A university romance about the confusion often felt by college youth regarding life and love. It has 10 episodes. If you made it at the end of the video, thank you so much. If you like my videos please subscribe, click on the like button or leave a comment, then have a nice day.